What's up, guys? You're back for more Upper Body Sculpt. I'm Terry, the Train OD, and I'm excited that you're here. We are going to get really in shape with this series. I hope you're as excited about it as I am. I obviously get really excited about fitness, right? So this one's going to be a tough one today. Supersets for pulling. Today's a pull day, so we're going to do lots of we're going to do some pull ups and we're going to do some suspension work. So let's get warmed up. All right, so let's start with our hands. We're gonna press the back, press back, warm up those wrists. We're gonna do about 10. You might hear a bunch of cracking and popping, that's just me, it's normal. Good, let's uh, interlace our fingers now and let's rotate our wrists in a circle. Warm up those wrists. And then we're going to go the other way. There you go. And then next is finger flicks. So we flick a you know, rush blood flow to the fingertips. Circulation is a good idea, okay? A couple more. Push them out. Starting to feel those forearms, aren't you? Good. Big circles now. Big circles, move over. Pull up bars, pretty big. There you go, let's go 10 each direction. And then we'll reverse it. Good, let's get to it. Check. Check. First thing we're gonna do, chin-ups. I have a band here, so if you uh, have one of these guys, it would be helpful for assisting. Otherwise, we're gonna get right to it. Doing 10, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, ten. All right, your chin-ups are always palms facing you, okay? Now we're gonna go down with the suspension trainer. Four inverted rows for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. Back to the pull-ups. I really like to do pull-ups. That's why you see me beaming with excitement. All right, 10 more. The rest if you got to. It's back to back. It's a... Uh, Strong work. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Whoo! This is why we have a band. Those are probably going to need it. All right, inverted rows. Okay. Catch your breath if you need it. Good. Let's go. Last set of 10. Let it rest at five. Catch your breath. Notice yourself starting to kip or kick. That's when you know you need to break, okay? So take a break. Finish your reps. Whew. 
Good. Last set of inverted rows. Two more. Oh yeah. Not so graceful. Not so graceful. Feeling it. Okay. We're back to the pull-up bar. This time we're gonna go pull-up, so we're overhand grip, but we're gonna use the band. So the band helps a lot. And I have a stool here to help me, so I'm gonna use a stool. So what you do is you stand up on the stool, take your band, press it down, put your foot on it, and the rest is up to you. One more. Woo, good work. It's just five. Back out you go. And we're going to adjust our suspension trainer. I'm going to bring it up a little bit. And we're going to do some lat pulls. So you're here. You use your legs a little bit, but you want to keep your arms behind you. One, two, three, four, five, rest. Okay, let's go. Six, seven, eight, nine, one more, and ten. Okay. So now you know the reps, five and ten, all right? Do it at your pace. Pause the video if you need to. If you don't have a pull-up bar, you can do the pulls on the suspension trainer as well, okay? Let's go. One more. Good. Back down we go. Here we go. You gotta do 10 down here. Four. Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. Catch your breath. Let's go. Back to the bar. Last set. Five more. You can do it. Good. Good, good, good. Out of this guy. We're going to move back here. Lap holes. Almost done. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Feels real good. Real good. Okay, we're going to make some adjustments here, and then we're going to go back to the bar. I'm going to put this back down, 
So otherwise we're about three feet off the ground, okay? We're back to the bar. This time we're gonna go wider on our pull-ups. And we're gonna go two, and then we're gonna rest. And we're gonna go two, and then we're gonna rest, and then two more. So we're going six this time, okay? Here we go. Uh, I did right foot, last three sets, so left foot. When you go out of this and you, and you come down to the floor, don't be afraid to explode. Good. I said two, but I did three. So I'm going to go three more. Are you ready? Woohoo! Feels like a superset. All right. To the suspension trainer, a little thing I like to call chicken wing. And we're going to lean back and we're going to do our inverted row with our knees at 90. And then you're going to open and shut. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. That's a tough one. All right, back to the pull-up bar. Three and three. Let's keep it that theme. Or you can do, do three sets of two. Whatever you got to do to get your sets. Then you don't need to break. To that I say congratulations, sir. Or ma'am, I don't really know. Are you ready? One more deep breath, ready? And go. You're gonna give yourself a rest. A rest, just a couple deep breaths, okay? so. One more. Let's go. It's good times. All right, make the switch. It's worth mentioning too, if you need to make this easier, take it to that angle or that angle. Makes it a little bit easier. Use a little more of your legs. We don't have much room, but there you go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Good. One more set of each. You guys are killing it. You're doing a good job. So wide grip, three and three, or three sets of two, whatever you gotta do to get to six. Here we go. Little variation. Did four. Rest, and I want to do two more. And doing it this way really focuses on the form so that we're not kipping and we're not jerking and kicking up in order to get the reps at sake of our joints. We don't want to forsake the joints or the muscles and tear something. Let's go. Good, you're done with those. Last set. Eight, nine, ten. Good work. It's short, but it is intense. All right, let's stretch it out a little bit. So we're gonna come down, use a suspension trainer, and push your arms away from you, drop your belly, and then maybe walk your legs back. Deep breathing, 
staying in a straight arm if you can. Couple more deep breaths. And then go ahead and bend your arms like so. Drop through. You can feel that stretch as it graduates up. I guess graduates down the body to your mid back, the lower lats, into your core. Very good. I like that stretch a lot. And now I'm going to put these guys behind me. Hands are in the fabric, so there's a little less, or a little lower. I'm going to try to sit back here, like so. This is too intense for you. You can sit on the floor with your hands behind your back, and that works fine. Maybe cross your legs, sit up taller. Really trying to push the arms back behind you. Good. Excellent job, everybody. I'm thankful for you. I'm glad you're here. Hope to see you again soon. Until then, have a great day.